Hello, my name is Krista and this is day nine of the Daniel Fast. One of the most encouraging aspects of our walk with Christ is that there's always an opportunity for more. We can experience more of His presence, more of His power, more of the miraculous through every situation. The Bible says His mercies are new every morning. So each day we can discover more in our relationship with the Lord. This means that we can continually have the opportunity to grow and become more like Jesus. Growth is healthy, necessary, and beneficial. It's something that most people desire in some area of their life, whether it's in business, leadership, spirituality, or abilities. But growth doesn't always happen naturally. It happens intentionally. In 1 Timothy 4, 7 through 8, Paul writes, have nothing to do with irreverent, silly myths. Rather, train yourself for godliness, for while bodily training is of some value, godliness is of a value in every way, as it holds promise for the present life and also for the life to come. In these verses, Paul urges believers to distance themselves from trivial and meaningless distractions and to embrace a life of godliness instead. But Notice that Paul tells us we must train for godliness. In other words, it's not automatic. Training for godliness becomes by orienting our life around God. Fasting and prayer are a couple of biblical ways we train for godliness. By abstaining from food or other desires for a specific period of time, we are training our bodies not to give in to their physical cravings. We can then redirect these desires to the deepening of our relationship with God. While we fast, we are learning to cultivate self-control, humility, and dependence on the Lord, and the end result is spiritual growth. Paul tells us that this kind of training holds promise for this life and the life to come. Spiritual training and growth benefit us today and for all eternity. As you continue through this fast, you'll find yourself growing closer to the Lord and strengthened by His power as a result of your obedience to pursue Him in a greater way. 